opportunities and making a change for the better. I think um, through football, obviously my background's football. That's the starting element, but also for education um, and just getting children to move really, remaining fit and bringing all that into one place where again, you can be multicultural from different backgrounds and it can all be at, it will be at ease with it together. I wish I'd had this when I was a kid. It's really nice, but um, that's what it's all about, I think. I think giving kids a, a better place to come and play, a better environment. And when it's nice like this, kids are going to want to come here more often, So, and that means they'll be more active. Huge. I think as I said, when I, I just look at things that when I was a kid, um, being a part of a community, being part of a youth club, so to speak, or a facility like this could only be beneficial to a young child because today I think kids are influenced and they're governed by their mobile phones or tablets. You need sites like this to be able to drag them out of their houses. I think the, the, the FA, I think um, the Football Foundation um, and other, other big organisations have made a real big investment in this, not only just through financial terms but time as well, through people, resources that they've put into stuff like this I think is vitally important um, and as I said it's not only just about football or sporting elements of it, I think from a community perspective I think it's important too. Fun, always having a good time, um, making friends. Um, my my facilities didn't really compare to this. Um, we're never as good as this, but these kids are lucky in that sense. So hopefully they'll be able to appreciate it and use it to its best ability.